Why are hydrogen compliance cars worth more in California than electric ones? And how much is a hacked Tesla Model S worth? It's been a busy week of news considering that it's July. This is the week in reverse for Friday, July 11, 2014, right here at Green Car Reports. Nissan made a splash at February's Chicago Auto Show with its Frontier Diesel Runner pickup concept, which was powered by a Cummins four-cylinder turbo diesel engine. Now, we've driven a prototype of that truck, and while it's torquey, we found its drivability to be a work in progress. While the U.S. has almost a quarter million plug-in cars on its roads today, there are fewer than 200 hydrogen fuel cell cars, among other reasons, because there are only a dozen or so places to fuel them up. Still, California rules give hydrogen vehicles an advantage. They get more zero-emission vehicle credits than battery electrics do. We explain how the math works. Oil producer Saudi Arabia wants cars and trucks in the kingdom to be more fuel efficient, so it's working on new gas mileage rules. But the cost of gasoline there will stay the same. It's now about 45 cents a gallon. Author David Noland, who's reported on his Tesla Model S for us, recently got a couple of chances to drive the new 2014 BMW i3 electric car. He shared his impressions of the i3 and considered how it stacks up against the larger, faster, and considerably pricier Tesla. Since it's summer now, your thoughts may be turning to road trips. Are you dreaming of curving routes winding through gorgeous scenery? If you want to do your road trip entirely on an electric motorcycle, like our contributor Ben Rich, he has some tips for you. Think you can hack into a Tesla Model S electric car? If you succeed, you might take home a $10,000 prize. Meanwhile, Tesla continues to cooperate with the police investigation into a multi-car Model S wreck in West Hollywood last week. The car thief who stole the electric luxury sedan and drove it at high speeds died this Friday, making him the first known Tesla Model S driver to die in a crash. Finally, two quick items. If you're driving a gas guzzler in Madrid, it'll cost you more to park. And if you've wanted a 2014 Cadillac ELR range extended luxury coupe, you can now get five-figure discounts on the $75,000 price. And that's before the $7,500 federal income tax.